The Cleveland Police Foundation is an alliance of business and civic leaders, law enforcement organizations, and individuals committed to the ideal that an educated, well-trained, and modernly equipped law enforcement agency leads to a safer community for all. It was a special year of giving when business leaders, volunteers, and police officers came together to share and donate goods, gifts, their time and talents to make our communities a better place. Merry Christmas! Cherise Goodrich is one of the teachers here. And she heard about our party that we have for our, our needy kids in the second district, and they wanted to do something. Willoughby East Lake Schools have given to the police uh, department for, I think this is the sixth year now, and so we wanted to make sure that we continued the tradition. And the kids here at the School of Innovation are extremely giving. We're helping the other kids that don't have presents, so um, we're coming to celebrate like helping others and working together. Every kid in the school made a stocking for our kid. And so what we'll do is on our Christmas party, each kid will get a, a stocking to go with a present, which will make uh, a kid's Christmas a little brighter. I like helping people because it feels good to you, just that you know that you're helping others. Change the world in a good way. So they're doing something good, they're giving back to the community, and we're doing some great things here. There was something for everyone when members of the Cleveland 2nd District Division of Police, the Cleveland Police Foundation, volunteers and businesses, all came together to make a very special Christmas for hundreds of people. Let me hear a ho, ho, ho. <laughs> this is the Second District Police Community Relations Children's Christmas Party. It's an event we hold every year here in the Second District. It gives an opportunity for kids in the community uh, who might not otherwise have a really nice Christmas, a chance to come out. Uh, interact with our police officers, interact with the Cleveland Police Foundation, get a gift, see Santa, have a nice, a nice meal. This is all about building a stronger community. This is about building a relationship between the police and the community. We want the police to also get to know the community that, that they protect and serve. These toys, these stockings, they're all tools that we use to build relationships with the, with the community. This is great, you know, to have uh, all these kids come out here, for us to be able to help out, give back to the community, and let them uh, once again see that, you know, we're human, you know, we have feelings, we, we appreciate them, uh, we care for them, and uh, we're, we're just normal people like everybody else. It's a beautiful event, you know, and we interacted with the, with the community, with the kids, and uh, their parents, so I, I think it's beautiful. And we can have more events like this here, you know, not only during Christmas time, but other times, you know, it would, it would go a long way as far as like showing like how we can all interact with each other in a, in a positive way. You know? It's really nice, like, to give back to the community. It's about the power of community. Everyone was getting into the act at the 35th Annual Cleveland Police Foundation Ronald McDonald House Christmas Party. Yeah. We're here with the Cleveland Police Foundation to give back to the community, but most of all, these kids need us more than anything. These kids are suffering from unthinkable problems, diseases, and it gives us great joy to give back to these kids. This is what it's all about. This is what we've been doing for the last few weeks now. Uh, Captain Salzer's uh, been spearheading our program for us, all the Christmas programs, and this is kind of an annual thing we do. We've been doing it for 35 years now. It's a heck of a program, it's a community thing, it's a community relations thing, uh, it's a community policing thing, which of course is very important these days, and uh, as you can see, it's a lot of interaction between the officers and the, the kids out here and the parents, uh, a worthy cause, and uh, we look forward to doing it every year. This is about the power of community. <laughs> it's about the power of community. Our mission is to strengthen the bonds between the Cleveland Division of Police and the citizens it serves through community engagement, support for police charities, and funding for specialized equipment and technology in order to help our police officers better perform their duties. One example is this year's Voices Against Violence, which brought together groups and community members for a day of fun and safety. 
The importance of what's happening today is that it brings awareness uh, to the community. Um, and for those who have been maybe victimized by domestic violence, by any type of violence, it lets them know that they're not alone. We're with them, we care, and everyone who showed up today also cares. The people are united, the blacks, the whites, all cultures are joining together. The Cleveland Police Department does a great job. I've rescued several kids in the Cleveland area and they've helped out every single time. We wanted to unveil today our, our truck. Uh, this is our Cops for Kids truck that the Cleveland Police Foundation purchased. Secondly, we wanted to unveil our little free libraries. It's given us the opportunity to get to know one another. We're rolling out into the neighborhoods to meet people in the community and our officers can get them to know them on a name-to-name -name basis. It's familiar, to, if we know people and they know each other, they get to learn and trust one another, and it all helps to build toward a stronger community. We just want to have the right relationship because our children need to see that police are to be respected and that they are here to help us and we are here to help them. In addition, the Cleveland Police Foundation proudly supports the following charities in accomplishing their mission. Cleveland Police Athletic League, Cleveland Police Historical Society and Museum, Greater Cleveland Peace Officers Memorial Society, Cleveland Police Pipes and Drums, Cleveland Police Honor Guard, Friends of the Cleveland Mounted Police, and Cleveland Cops for Kids. The purpose of PAL is, number one, to have positive interactions between the police and kids. Uh, two, to try to keep kids uh, out of trouble and doing positive things. They love it, you know. You know, uh, I think it's, it's a great opportunity, man. You know, so many kids don't have much to do after school. You know, I think it's good. It really is rewarding to see true collaboration in action. To see the business community, to see our police officers, the Cleveland Police Foundation. The St. Luke's Foundation all work together for the best interests of our children, which always contributes to the well-being of our community. It's important because it helps bring the businesses and the Cleveland police as well as the community together. I think uh, Sarge do a great job at it. Getting us to, you know, like I said, make sure we have everything we need. He comes out here often, he calls, he talk, we talk all the time, so. I think with the community and the police working together and getting these kids a message that, uh, you know, this is the way to go. If you've got a goal, uh, go for it, and uh, down the line it'll pay off. And I learned that growing up myself. Yeah, it's about teamwork and 